can, you can turn it into a positive, but yeah, it's primarily a, a, a trauma effect, so to speak. <laughs> I may have screwed myself over. Yeah. So, <laughs> hi everybody. Welcome back to the second hour of the special edition of Once Upon a Game. We're playing Home by Dark. Um, I'm super excited to get into this game and start playing. Um, our story that we have is something like a 1930s uh, Kansas with um, a dragon and and a carnival that wants him back. And we're getting ready to see how it all is going to, like, mingle together. And, oh, boy, our, we have some, like, really, like, weird, twisted, like, soap opera-ish family issues. <laughs> it's, oh, my God, it's perfect. Awesome. I love it. So let's let's get into this. Okay. So, Jason, uh, take it away. All right. So the first thing that we do, uh, now that we're into Act 1, is we prepare the story pillars. Uh, the story pillars have dice on them, uh, which basically just sort of represent their strength. Uh, the story pillar or the uh, secret starts off with one die automatically and the pursuer and danger start with a pile equal to the number of players. So four on each of them. So as you can see, the secret starts off a little weak. We're going to hopefully try to strengthen it while we're uh, trying to uh, weaken the, both the pursuer and the danger. Um, the, the way that we uh, do that is by playing out these scenes individually. Uh, when, uh, Basically, we're going to go around uh, our group twice. Uh, each person will get two scenes uh, around the virtual table, so to speak. And when uh, one player sets up a scene, what they're going to do is choose a uh, choose a story pillar that they want to work on. So in the case of the, the secret, uh, they may want to help protect it, make sure it's safe, maybe learn more about it. Uh, in the case of the pursuer, they may try to confront it, uh, try to uh, 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 bewilder it, confound it, and in terms of the danger, they want to learn more about it, understand it, and hopefully uh, you know, uh, pre prepare themselves to try to avert it. Uh, in all three cases, uh, you cannot stop the pursuer or danger, and simultaneously you uh, don't have to worry about us losing the secret throughout the game. Uh, these are us trying to... Uh, strengthen and weaken them, and then the final confrontation at the end of the entire game will determine whether we were successfully able to stop them or protect the secret, etc. Um, going back to the uh, choosing the pillar, after you choose the pillar, the second part that you're going to do is ask a question. This question will help define the scene. Uh, it will always be a yes-no, positive-negative question, um, and it should be geared towards uh, the positive, uh, the, the yes answer being a positive result, the no answer being a negative result. Uh, as an example, uh, in the secrets, uh, let me go to a couple of examples that I've written in preparation. Um, do we discover that the secret is sick? That could be a yes or no. Or in this case, it'd be, uh, do we discover that the secret isn't sick because you don't want it to be sick? So positive is yes, negative is no. In terms of the pursuer, does the pursuer not track us down while we hide in the shed? That would be a legitimate question, yes, no. The reason that you ask it as a yes, no, is you will be playing out the scene towards resolving that question. And when you get to the point where you need to know the answer, that's where our dice come into effect, uh, the hope dice and the responsibility dice. Each story pillar has uh, different dice requirements. The secret can only use hope dice. The pursuer can only use responsibility dice, and the danger can use both. So as an example, an adult trying to help the secret, not useful because they're nothing but responsibility dice, and the secret requires hope dice. Mm. Uh, trying to confront the pursuer as a child, not as useful because of the fact that the pursuer only deals with responsibility dice, and kids usually only have hope dice. The danger is good, well, good is a relative term, of course, but the danger is uh, able to be dealt with by both um, hope dice and responsibility dice. Everyone can contribute towards that. Um, once you've decided your question, you have the ability to add uh, people to participate. Um, that's uh, specifically a mechanical term. You can have one person come in to participate for free. That means they're going to be part of the scene. And then you can spend one character point to have another person brought in to participate as well. Uh, they're able to play in the scene, and mechanically speaking, they can contribute one die of the type um, towards the uh, resolution role. 
the other use of uh, character dice or character points are that you can uh, bring in an asset for one character point, or you could bring or and you can bring in a uh, location for one character point. Both of those will also bring in one die each. When we get to the resolution, when we get to the point where we have to figure out, you know, did this, did our work help or not? Um, we roll our dice versus the opposition pool, which in Act One is three dice, and one, twos, and threes are fails. Four, fives, and sixes are successes. We then look at the difference in successes, and for every success that uh, we win on the secret, we add dice, and on the pursuer in danger, we remove dice. And if we lose, for every one we lose, the secret loses a die, and the pursuer in danger add dice. So the danger and pursuer can become more powerful, and the uh, secret can get weaker. And you'll never end up with anything lower than zero. Um, one item worth noting, since we are the heroes of the story, ties are considered one success uh, for us. So we're always the, the positive on that. Um, and that's kind of the, the short of uh, how a scene individually works. And it looks like Eric is the first one on the list, so he'll get to pick his, uh, his scene setting uh, first. Okay. Um... All right, so it's already assumed that we already know what the secret is, and it's already had, it's already yes. uh, kept. Um, that actually, like sorry, that does bring up one one thing I forgot, which is, uh, in terms of like, if this was a film, we've effectively already finished Act One by the time we start this. In that, we have we've already uh, met the secret, and we have decided to protect it. But one of the things that we as a group need to decide is, how did we meet it, and why did we decide to protect it? Uh, this is done just before the first uh, the first scene. Uh, does anybody have any particular desire about how how we met this this baby dragon? Oh, I see a hand raised. <laughs> yeah, it's my responsibility, Dad. What can I say? Um, <laughs> well, I think the way that ties in the most characters right off the bat is I was trying to impress Amelia, so I was like, "Yo, let's go to the carnival." There's a carnival in town, so I take her to the carnival and. Mr. Kellogg, uh, I don't think he trusts me very much, so maybe he follows behind, but that's up to Mr. Kellogg. And, of course, I bring you because little brother's right. always a great yeah, wingman. Exactly. Yeah. exactly. He's my little brother. I'm going to protect him. I have to watch him. I'm not leaving not him anywhere right. near Mr. Kellogg. Mm -hmm. um, just, like, stuff like that. So I think what probably happens is something happens. Baby dragon flies, too. Zeke, obviously. Mm -hmm. And I'm like, Zeke, what? no. We can't. <laughs> you are, you're not old enough for that. Did we like, that is a lot of you something at the carnival or did it did follow you, us home from the you, carnival? Well, I like, okay, here's an idea. Yeah, if it either followed you home, it either followed you home or like the idea that maybe like you just like won an egg and then it like hatched or something. Oh, yeah. yeah. Or something yeah. like that, like. But you won the wrong well, egg. Like you, like, like you won a lizard. Like you won like a Noli because you did like the little ring toss on the bottles. And you know, yeah, talking yeah. about the goldfish or whatever. So, it's like it was. So it just yeah, got so thrown in, in with that uh, inadvertently. It's so in, in <laughs> So in, in so in the movie, there was a scene before we got to the, the carnival of the dragon doing stuff and getting accidentally getting into the prize pool for like a, a game or yeah, something like that. And, and yeah, exactly. And then yeah, you inadvertently and the carny, didn't, the carny didn't know. It was yeah. like, oh, uh, you get you get this lizard thing. Yeah. yeah. Here you go. Here and, you and go, he son. Give it to Amelia. So he's like, uh, here, Zeke, you have this. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> no, no. So I think, I think, yeah, I was going to win it. I was just, you know, showing off like women love a guy who can ring toss. I mean, look at this. <laughs> yeah. Or maybe, um, maybe it was like yeah. shooting or something, right? Like it was a marketing yeah, maybe, thing. Yeah, it was a VV, shot, it was, shot the little bottles. Whatever, yeah, I, shot the, I shot right. the bottles, stuff like that. Well, I think I like, I just like the idea of the scene of Zeke being like, Robbie, 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 he can breathe fire. Robbie, he can breathe fire. <laughs> we have to return that. We have to return that right now that we know this is, I don't want to be involved in this. And then Millie being like, no, we have to protect it. And I'm like, yep, what she said, absolutely. One of us. <laughs> Check the lizard. Like, I have been about this from day one. <laughs> All right. Like, so I think, I think I have a scene in mind for the okay. scene. Go for it. Uh, but okay. here's, I have a question though. Um, yeah. We never, we never described the uh trainer or whatever from the carnival mm -hmm. um so i'm going to leave this open as as the scene here um 
does does the pursuer um, get onto us when we have to go in town to buy uh, food for for the creature that Ooh. we're keeping it back at the farm? I like that. Okay, um, that's a good question. And so, uh, is this against the secret or the pursuer itself? Oh, this, it could be either one at this point. Oh yeah, I was thinking this would be against the pursuer. Okay, that makes sense. So hypothetically, sir, if you had a baby dragon, what would you feed? <laughs> yeah. So the idea that I have is that I think this scene. Um, I'm not sure who determines who's participating in the scene. Um, you but get if, to you get to determine. Okay, because I'm framing it. Okay, cool. Mm-hmm. Um, I think I think this will just be me and um, I think Zeke because Zeke's the most excited for it and like. I'm like, you know, we probably have the first part of it being like, I'm getting in my truck to go downtown. And then Zeke's like, come on, like, we got to go get some food for the dragon. And be like, oh, okay, come so on, one, come along. One note, though, is come that along, since, I'm, since I'm all hope, I won't be able to contribute towards the answer of that question, just as a note. Oh, I, I would need hope. Oh, okay. You'd need another responsibility person in there. Oh, oh so the, this, that's this good to know. The then, it's, then it's Robert. Then I got I to gotta bring Robert along. The order. The order, son. Okay. No, that's that's really good to know. Don't you dare uh, just, call just me as a note. <laughs> so as a note, because I realized I, I told you how to spend character points, but not how to get them. So the cards that you've been given, the insecurity and fear from the other people, and the uh, the two the wonder reason cards, when you use them um, the first time, they go away, but in return you get two character points. And at the end of a scene, if you ha- if you want to, you can spend two character points to uh, get that third die I was telling you about. That's the one other thing you can use the die for. Yeah. Okay. So keep those in mind while you're playing, because I've noticed that, uh, especially in the first few scenes, uh, it's easy to forget that you have those cards to spend. So sure, sure. Keep them in mind. Cool. Okay. Yeah. Right. So I'll probably I'll probably be reaching out to you when I have a couple questions about like how to achieve that and mechanics and stuff like that. Absolutely. But, okay. Um, yeah. So, like, for instance, right now, obviously, I think this scene should take place in the general store. Um, Sounds but good. Doesn't that cost a die or something to do that? To invoke uh, that? If, if you wanted to mechanically help you, yes. If you just want to go there and you don't want to spend any, you can just you can just have it take place there. You just won't get a bonus from it if you don't spend the die. Oh, I, I like to spend the die though. So I'm going to spend okay. my die to uh, to invoke the bonus for the general right. store. So. so so just to give you the math where it's at right now, you have two responsibility dice, mm-hmm. and um, uh, Robbie is contributing one because he's participating, and then you get one more because you've spent it on the general store. So right now you're at four dice. Yeah. Right now they're going to have three dice on their roll when you get to the resolution phase. Okay, Excellent. cool. Okay, cool. So, um, so we should be trying to address the question, right? Okay, so... Yeah. <laughs> um, Zeke, or excuse me, uh, Robert, you've brought with so it's, it's you and me here. Uh, we're probably having a disagreement over like what to feed this thing, and uh, they might be like overhearing it, and then we have to like come up with a way to for them to not hear, like like to think that we're talking about something else, right? So um, the idea that I have is that I probably am. I'm probably like. Try. I'm gonna like ask the general store manager. Uh, his name's Chuck, or no, no, his name's Joe because he's a traitor. Um, <laughs> and uh, so we're gonna ask we're gonna ask our pal Joe here, um, what kind of deals he has on meat. I'll play and, Joe. Okay, cool. Yeah, I was gonna ask. Okay, awesome, great, great. Um, and then I guess somehow. Robert may disagree with us or something like that. Okay. So anyway, so like, you know, we hear the, like the chime thing of the door, um, you know, uh, and we, we, we walk in and uh, we see, we see Joe behind the counter polishing something or, you know, something like that. And it's like, Hey, how's it going, Joe? Hey, not too bad. Hey, nice dusty day. Can't complain. Can't complain. Yeah. You, uh, did you make it out to the harvest festival yet? Looks like they still need some people setting up stuff and, Oh, not yet. I'm planning to, and uh, probably this evening. Get out there, nice, uh, nice uh, evening. See all the people, relaxing. Robert has yeah. walked away from the two of you, and is just like looking at ammunition on a wall or something, just because yeah. like your small <laughs> talk just annoys him because hey, you're yeah, you. Yeah. <laughs> because you're you. Yeah. <laughs> I would, yeah, I would love to make it to lobby with you, huh? Yeah, mm-hmm. he needs he needs to get a few things too, so. Yeah, brought him along. Hey, hey, Joe. 
Hey, Robbie. Have Robert. a good day? Oh, sorry. Robert, having a good day? <laughs> so far, so good. I have no complaints. Woke up this morning a little early, made sure all the fields are in good order, had to kill a couple of gophers, you know how it is. Oh, yes. It is gopher season. You got to watch out for those things. Uh, if, I have any, if I have anything to do with it, it won't be gopher season for long. But I've been teaching uh, teaching Robert here the uh, the value of hard work, and that's why Robert will be joining with me tonight at the farm and not going to the Harvest Festival tonight with Amelia. As well, I like to look over at you. Let me, just, let me just look at my cards real quick. <laughs> yeah. I think, honestly, that might set off my f- fucking fear. <laughs> <laughs> oh, well, I don't know what your fear is. I know you I, I never, know. I know that, but, like, you know, I'm just, like, being that kind of stern thing. Like, I need yeah, you yeah. around the place tonight and not going out. Like, we had this prior discussion. Mm-hmm. Um, and I just, and- just kind of look at you and I'm like, my fields are in working order. They look fine. They're fantastic. Like, the harvest will be fine. Yeah. So I'm gonna actually play the uh, his his fear, which is yeah. I'll never be the man my father was. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> which yeah. which nets me uh, two uh, two character points. So that's worth noting. <laughs> Literally the second I gave you that fear, and you're like, no, it's mostly negative. I'm just like, because <laughs> <laughs> for the record my dad was just the best at literally everything so yeah he was like the poster child right he was literally yeah. all american yeah. whatever yeah. blah 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 he, w- um, he was the best at everything except for surviving a war apparently <laughs> yep so so he set off your fear there <laughs> yeah. so there's probably someone else like a stranger um like browsing around right like it yeah, probably yeah. might be actually someone connected to the carnival or like will end up feeding information to the carnival person. Um, so the question, so I, I've, so I think that's probably going on. So Tux, you might be able to play that person if you want. Um, and just fill out whatever details you want for that person. But anyway, yeah, sure. I, I, I go like, so, uh, listen, Joe, I need, uh, I need your help here. I know, I know the, uh, the harvest festival has a lot of, um, you know, a lot of needs. I'm sure they're hitting you up with a lot of stuff, but, um, listen, what are your deals on, on meat, particularly, uncooked? Uh, uncooked. Uncooked. You know, freshly, fre- uh, freshly butchered, if you if you still got some. Oh, uh, well, I think we've got a couple of couple of uh, slabs of uh, uh, steak left. Uh, if you're interested, it's getting close to the time I need to throw it out. I could probably give you a good discount. Still fresh enough. Or we oh. could be real men and just go out hunting. Ooh. Robert being very tough. <laughs> Yeah, no, I like I mutter as, that under my yeah, no, it's like, like, you, but it's a but it's a stage whisper that you are meant to hear. <laughs> yeah, but we can see. Yeah, and and uh, okay, so it wasn't meant to hear. Okay, I was yeah, gonna no, say yeah. No, no, you, you hear it, and you know damn well that I want you to hear it. Right. Yeah, and I, I just like, I, I, I nudge I nudge like Joe over the table. I'm like Robert here thinks he's a uh, keen old uh, Daniel Boone. Hmm. Well, I remember his father being a good shot. I'm sure he'll grow up to be one, too. And I, I look at him and I'm like, we'll see. We'll see. And, I would like to spend a point to get my ass up. <laughs> <laughs> I would like to kill yeah. Herman real quick, please. <laughs> we'll you know. he's, got a, he's got his father's heart, but... Um, you know, he's got a he's got a little bit of. A, so anyway, Joe. So are you going to sell us the meat, or is he just going to keep running? His <laughs> yeah, mouth? I like the way that you take over it. Yeah. Oh, of course. Uh, uh, Twenty-two cents. Yeah, I throw a dollar on the table. Oh, this is, this is in the, and then I look I look at Herman and I say, "You think? Don't worry." And I like I look at you and I go like, "Don't worry, harvest was good this year. I have it." And I say, and I look at you and I go, "Buy yourself something nice." As I slide a dollar across the table to you. Oh. Burn. <laughs> All right. It sounds like what? What was the question one more time? Well, so the the question was whether or not to pursue a role. Um, get a hint oh. that that we have the the creature. Yeah. Right. So this would probably be a good point for the resolution because uh, sure, I think sure. so, 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 the volume of the conversation <laughs> enough for to hear. <laughs> yeah, yeah. So I'm, I'm assuming like the, there's like a stranger near that's able to hear the conversation while they're like looking at a, another shelf or something like that. So. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I guess the rules probably whether or not they hear this as suspicious or it's just people buying meat. 
Exactly. Right? Yeah. If, yeah, if, yeah. If the pursuer succeeds, Thank I probably yeah, muttered exactly. something I shouldn't have muttered. Like, yeah, 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 that's good. It's like, what the fuck do you even feed a dragon? Like, like they know, they dragons. know both of those guys don't have any uh, things that I don't know. <laughs> Raising lions? I don't fucking know. <laughs> yeah, or like you guys buy like a I'm lot sorry, of I don't. Yeah, like dogs. So, like, 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 we were raising a dog like, or yeah, something. Something like that. Yeah, well, we can. Yeah. Yeah. Right. <laughs> okay. Something like that. Right. Perfect. Cool. Okay. So, great. Great. Go ahead and uh, uh, roll uh, four dice versus uh, three. I'm not as versed in the the roll foo on this thing. Oh yeah. Okay. Um. So what you can do? It, who's Maybe Tux, you can do the um the sure. the pursuer, right? The so, opposition um, one. So, that's so, okay. so um for the the actual resolution, it's um over four is a success, right? Four or over, yes. Okay, so okay. should we do um three d six greater than four? Well, you're rolling three d six, and I think I'm rolling four d six. Yeah. Okay. You don't have to really get fancy. Just four rolls four. You roll three. All right, I got three successes. Ooh. Hi, right, Tux. Screwed up. Yep. Oh, okay. So we netted two, which means that we have uh, removed two of the dice off of the pursuer. We have weakened it. So the answer is no to your question. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. So maybe. So, yeah, so like the guy, like um, there's like there's a guy that's kind of like got uh, uh, like a button shirt and like um, maybe like just you know dressed pretty like pretty casually with like a hat on or something. Too um, casually. <laughs> too casually <laughs> he's probably even like <laughs> he's got a little bow tie hidden underneath it <laughs> i think i think what actually happens is uh he's too focused on what he's doing to hear you guys talking and what he's doing is looking for the dragon but he's too focused on like so he's like he's like looking at like like the um like the trapping stuff so he's like he's like got like he's looking at like rope and like a bear trap and he like got a bunch of stuff in his hands and he like like sets it on the counter and um, and like uh, when you're done with these two, I, I need to buy uh all of this. <laughs> yeah, like it's literally uh ships passing in the night kind of thing. I was gonna say like as yeah. we walk out, like yeah, so, yeah you see like yeah, you see like a big the- rope, a bear trap, like a box yeah. of ammo. Ooh, Love it. Like yeah, no hunting. I see. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> like as for some, as, for some, uh, for as some, we walk. Uh, for some uh, very uh, unique game. <laughs> I was about to say, like, as we're walking out, you just like very subtly hear someone go. You just hear him go. Is that any dragons? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Perfect. Yeah. This guy's told like he thinks he's gonna catch him, and like he like he know he like he knows he's gonna catch him, but like he's probably not gonna catch him. He's one of the moots. Okay. Yeah. He's so this is um. So now it's Tux's scene. So now yep. it works next. Okay. Sure. Um. So I, my idea is I would like to have a scene with Zeke and okay. we are, um, with, with the secret. Okay. Uh, back at the homestead. Um, and I guess the question, so we've, we've met the secret. We've kind of like already had all the intro scenes with the secret and like, um, have we named the secret yet? It doesn't seem like we have. I feel like this is not too long after we probably brought it back, so maybe we haven't come up with the name yet. Yeah, yeah. Uh, so I guess for a yes or no question that I would like Just to answer, maybe, yeah. maybe I think maybe uh, I was wondering. Like, I was thinking like maybe like Amelia and Zeke are like trying to figure out what what uh, the dragon can do. I'm not, I guess trying to frame that in a yes or no question. So maybe maybe like is there anything we have to is there anything special we have to worry about with this dragon? Okay, uh, that sounds good. So we're trying to figure out if he has any uh, any uh, like weaknesses that we need to be concerned yeah, about. Weaknesses, if he's like a danger to us, like if he's like something we like. Oh, he doesn't like this thing because it makes him freak out or whatever. Like, yeah, yeah something like that. Like, so like it's like the it's the testing period where they're like, okay, what can you do? And they like they pl- they play fetch with him or something or like yeah that kind of stuff. That sounds good. So you're spending the uh, the character point on the uh, homestead and bringing me in for free, mm-hmm. um, and you have one hope die. So one, two, three. So it'll be three versus three when we get to the resolution on that one. Okay. Cool. All right. I'm, I'm uh, just before you begin, Jason, yeah. I whispered you a question. Oh. 
about your insecurity because it's actually kind of important whether or not I can play it against you or fear. Oh, um, do, do, do. I mean, you can really just give me a one or a two on that one, first one or second one. <laughs> <laughs> not, not the new one. Okay. <laughs> Good. All right. Good. Because you would have had a new fear. <laughs> okay. So, um, I think like, so we're at the homestead, like we're at the big, like, there's the bit, like the, the, they have, like, we established by like coming over like the big field and like the house. And then we go around to uh, a barn and then we come into that and um, our, our like secret sleeping place for the dragon is like a hay pot, like a, a big thing of hay that's like hidden back underneath oh, like, God. Like, a, like a, a, a bunch of barrels or something like that. Also known as a fire hazard. I understand. Yeah. It's surrounded by a bunch of oils, oil drums, right? <laughs> <laughs> and some some TNT for good measure. Yeah, dad, dad was an oil tycoon, and he kept all the oil in the right next to the flammable lantern and the easily spooked cow. Exactly. What could go wrong? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so I think we, like we come into there um, with the dragon. Uh, so, what, what does our dragon look like? Ah, that's a good question. I'm thinking yeah. kind of. I mean, okay, in my head, and I know it's not this, but my head, I keep thinking Spyro. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Yeah, 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 yeah. Fat dragon. Um, like, probably scaly, I would imagine. Mm -hmm. um, yeah, like, it's not a luck dragon. <laughs> yeah, exactly. It's not the feathery kind uh, or the uh, furry kind. Um, I'm also thinking, like, because it's so young, it's got very vibrant, like, like scales, the very... Sure. Yeah, yeah, like some sort of like bright color, like yeah, like a like a purple or a blue or a, um, yeah, like an orange or something like, like that. Like almost iridescent the way it reflects. You yeah, know? That, I, you know. I mean, yeah. Obviously, when we got it first off, it like was like a dull gray or whatever, like as a baby. But then it's like started shedding and it started doing these purple things. And I was like, the, I was like the Act One thing, right? And then yeah, the yeah. discovery of this. We thing. thought it was a weird lizard, and then I was like, yeah. now it's getting skills and oh it has wings it has now. wings yeah Same. like it like it like grew wings yeah like it like yeah, it yeah. literally like molted into a dragon right right, right. yeah is okay. it bigger than a bread box how big is baby dragon? <laughs> um we talking like i'm baby thinking dragon? like we talking baby dragon or we talking baby dragon i'm in my head i keep thinking like like a fat pug <laughs> yeah, yeah yeah me too that's what i, I was I, yeah i was gonna say like smaller than a corgi Mm -hmm. Oh, that's a that's not a dragon. That's a uh, that's our uh, that's our chihuahua in a dragon costume. <laughs> Happy Halloween, everybody! Yeah. Yeah. Harvest. So this well, is you know, it's, it's probably weighs like, you know, you could carry with one hand if you needed to. It's probably like twenty pounds or so, like twenty five pounds. Oh, okay, yeah. I don't know how heavy dragons are, but you know what I mean. It's, <laughs> it's not a not a dragon. This one expert. is a particularly light dragon because we're still trying to figure out what the fuck to feed it. Exactly. <laughs> it may be a little slim for the last couple of days since we haven't probably figured it out yet. <laughs> we're like, why do you like these cranes? We yeah, we've been giving it like bugs and it's like doesn't care. Right, exactly. Right? <laughs> like, How about it really get like into the meat at some point and we're like, oh, it likes meat. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Okay, right, cool. So yeah, we um we come in on uh Amelia and uh and Zeke, and then the dragon's like kind of like in between or something. Like like we see like Amelia's back and Zeke's back, and like the dragon's sitting like in the hay. Um, like we probably got like a bone or something, and it's like playing with it or whatever. And um, eat the bone, hey, catch it. Whoa, he's flying off towards it. Oh, he seems to at least know that half. <laughs> yeah, he's, he does, he, he likes he likes to play. That's for sure. I wonder if there's anything he can. I, so I mean, in all in all the stories and stuff they taught us, like dragons could always do with some like crazy stuff. I wonder if I wonder if I wonder if I wonder if it can do anything. Yeah, well, I remember them. Uh, there was a book that school ma'am read that uh, they flew. So maybe if maybe if I throw it in the air, it'll it, it'll fly. But yeah, it, yeah, if you want to try it. I could. I mean, do you think it would break its dragon bones? I, 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 I don't know. Actually, this is this is all as new for me as it is for you, Zeke. Mm. I'm real scared to try it. I don't want to break its dragon bones. <laughs> well, it didn't work that time. <laughs> <laughs> 
Maybe it needs to learn like a bird. <laughs> I think we need some some hay or something. This this could get painful. Yeah, I, I, let, let, maybe maybe we'll, let's not let's 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 not toss it up in the air anymore for at least for a little while. Oh, okay, okay. Well, uh, <laughs> what what else do dragons do? Um, do they do they? I remember. I think dragons like sniff around for like mushrooms, or is that pigs? If, I don't think that's dragons. Oh, hmm. <laughs> well, um, maybe. Well, the, usually, usually they uh, usually in the stories they're fighting some sort of knight and breathing fire all over him. Oh, well, uh, do you think it can breathe fire? Uh, pick up some hay, kind of burn it. <laughs> burn it. <laughs> I like wrap burn. my arm around its belly and kind of lightly squeeze. Burn it. Burn hey, I, 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 I look around at the giant pile of hay and the wood of the barn. Like, I, I, maybe we should go outside first. Oh, uh, all, all right. Well, I suppose uh, you know best. <laughs> Let's go. Um, oh, dra- dragon. Let's go, dragon. We yeah. Have a name for you know him. What, we don't. We don't. We don't have a name for him yet. Mm. He needs a. He needs a, a proper name because yeah. he's a dragon. Like um, Reginald, or maybe uh, Duke. Duke sounds very fancy. I like that. I like Duke. Duke the Dragon. Duke the Dragon. All right. He sounds royal, like a fancy man. Yeah. All right. Let 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 let's let's see if Duke can do anything cool. All right. <laughs> Take him out into the the open <laughs> the open yard of the homestead. <laughs> uh, Get the bone, no, but fly. He's not flying. How do you? Maybe, maybe he just has, maybe he just has to. He just has to go in, get grow into it or something. Hmm, I suppose. They don't look like very long wings. Mm-hmm. I would imagine you need big ones. He did, he did just grow them. Of course, he could be like a bumblebee. They got those tiny wings, but eh, I don't want to hurt them. Let's mm-hmm. try the fire thing. How how do you think we can get them to 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 fire to burn? Maybe. Hmm. I don't suppose kerosene would be the best idea. Hmm. Maybe not. Maybe. Maybe I don't. He's probably. He well. If he hasn't done it yet, then he probably doesn't know how. Maybe we like need to teach him. Maybe. <sighs> maybe we could get some charcoals and burn them so he could see what burning's like. And I got actually. I got an idea. Okay. Ah. Uh, I'll be right back. And like, uh, Amelia runs inside the house. Um, and then a couple minutes later comes back with like a, like a little sack. Um, and she comes back out and, uh, this, this happens sometimes in like fairy tales and stuff. So we're going to see how it works. I don't know what's going to happen. Uh, and she like, she like, come here Duke. And then like tries to get him to come close with you and then throws a bunch of pepper in his face. Yeah. (laughs) <laughs> and shall we roll to see if the sneezing causes him to shoot flames that seems legit <laughs> oh, good oh, luck that's to us. so cute this is what happens when the responsible people go out to the store to buy food <laughs> yeah <laughs> dragon so uh 3d6 yes okay Oh my! Oh no! Oh, I'm pressing buttons. I didn't mean to. <laughs> uh, and we tied then, right? Uh, well, he gets three three d six as well. Um, how do how do I do the? Sorry, I'm slash roll space three d six greater than four. Oh. Yep, no space. Uh, oh, af- no space after the slash r. Slash, uh, slash r three d. Oh, slash r three d six is all one thing. No, slash R space 3D6. R space 3D6. Greater than 4. Oh, you have a period. Ah. Yeah, you have a period. Yeah, but... Ta-da! Oh, oh my. my. <laughs> so, oh, apparently, we did not power him up. We actually lost the one uh, die we have currently on him. <laughs> no! Darn it. <laughs> and, unfortunately, the answer to the question is yet. <laughs> okay, so... Yes. 
No, nothing, nothing uh, crazy or special about him. Not yet. It is just a lizard with that can fly. Yeah. Well, I think <laughs> so, it's probably, it's probably just like an adorable little like, <laughs> like it sneezes a bunch of a few times, whatever. And it's like, oh, hmm. okay. I guess it, I guess Duke can't. I guess there's no fire there then. Hmm. Well, I guess he, that's good. Like pepper. I guess that's good. We are keeping him in a park. <laughs> <laughs> we don't want to teach him that too early. <laughs> right. All right. How about we? Let, let, let's stop worrying about what he can do. About kind of too many tricks. Uh, let's keep playing with him. Have some fun. Sounds good. I keep throwing the bone for him to go grab and attempt to at least teach him to bring it back. Yeah, or for, teach teach him fetch. Yes. Awesome. <laughs> All good dragon pets should know fetch. <laughs> Awesome. All right. So I believe uh, is Jay's turn. Hmm. We've all we've been nice and fluffy so far. So how can I make it not so nice or fluffy? <laughs> we need to darken this up. Literally, yeah. That's what I want to do. <laughs> I mean, my asset is a pistol. I'm gonna. Leave <laughs> I'm gonna make the gun go bang. Um. I think I'm going to go with uh, the danger is going to be my pillar. Okay. Um, which is responsibility? It's yeah. uh, both, actually. It's both. Okay. Um, and I'm going to have Amelia be part of this scene. Okay. If, if she'll kindly. Sure, totally. Um, so I think the scene as is, is, um, so right now I think, I think Robbie's a little bit in the friend zone. Um, like we're sitting in the barn, um, like, uh, we're, no, we're sitting on the porch or something. We're sitting out of sight of like the livestock and stuff like that. Um, and like, you're just talking feelings kind of a sort of thing. Like, yeah, yeah. Cool. Yeah, like we're just you know we're just gonna shoot the shit. So like, Robbie and Robbie is um, and I'm gonna spend my character point to bring my asset in. Cool. Is Duke with us or is he uh, is Duke in the barn? Uh, Duke's not with us now. Okay. Well, are you kidding? That'll block him. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, no, so. you, you you no you use the pet to get them close and then. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> You laugh, but um. No, anyways, um. Yeah, so <laughs> I, I can't actually move my character point, but uh, yeah, I have my. I'm gonna yeah. have my dad's service pistol. Cool. Um, and I'm I'm we're sitting on the porch, and like, I think this has been like a ritual for us for a while. Well, yeah, what's the what's the kids. question for the for the scene? Um, I think the the question for the scene is like, uh, I'm trying to think about it. It's like so something happens, and I'm gonna respond. Um, so I guess the question is like, is either going to be like, so it has to be yes or no? Uh, yes. Yes. Um, it's either, ugh, crap, I'm stuck between like. This is a danger scene, right? Mm -hmm. uh, yeah, this is danger. Okay. Um, it's, it's either going to be, can, uh, can I protect or can we figure out what it is? One of those two. But I'm, I'm, I, you want to kind of roll with it until you figure it out. Yeah, like, that's fine. That's it's, fine. Yeah, it's gonna be one of those two though. You'll cool. I'll I'll, I'll throw my M Night Shyamalan twist in there in just a second. Don't worry. <laughs> so, yeah, um, so I'm I'm cleaning off the pistol, and um, you know you're probably talking about like school because I've dropped out, but you're still going. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> like, but I'm, like I'm super supportive about it. <laughs> I feel like, like Tom Tom Petty. I'm sorry, Tom Petty like wrote a concept album of this entire. <laughs> I'm just sorry. I'm just sitting out there showing my guitar thing about the my American Hitch Dragon West. tour. <laughs> sorry, I'm so sorry. Continue. Yeah, yeah. So yeah, we come come down and like uh, um, yeah. School's gonna be starting up soon. It's gonna be my last year. Yeah. Well, you're gonna be doing a good job. So. You know, keep at it. If you need any help, I'm I'm no good at math, but <laughs> I'm good moral support. You are, you are. I do, I do try my best. <laughs> so, you do you know what you're going to be doing then, or 
you just you just schooling for the sake of schooling. I, I want to do something. I just don't know what yet. Uh, I uh, hey tax. Yeah. Hey tax. <laughs> what's what's up? <laughs> um, I think I think that might be relevant. You calling on my fear. fear? I think that might be relevant to your fear. <laughs> um, your fear is that you won't amount to anything important. That's true. And um, I think I, th- <laughs> I think this is relevant. That is true. That is also true. <laughs> so, um, <laughs> Playing that card. Yeah, I'm going. I'm going to play that card. <laughs> so that gives you two uh, character points. Sweetness. So magic. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> yeah no so so after you say that you probably go like really quiet or something yeah or or, or, or she maybe like says something like or like, like yeah i, I want to do something i just don't know what yet or let me good at much of anything afterwards uh, i think i put the i put the pistol down i put the uh model 1903 down and i look at you and i go amelia amelia kellogg you look at me you look at me right in the eye you can accomplish anything you set your heart out to do <laughs> whatever you choose to do i will be here for you and like as i start talking i think we hear like this noise <laughs> no like oh, not even like, that like, the, the low drum of the swooping oh yeah no, just the wings no, yeah, no, yeah, no, yeah. No, no, no. i think i think what we hear is like first we hear livestock oh. and, we, and then we maybe <laughs> we hear like <laughs> And then yeah. we hear the sound of like maybe like rending flesh or something. Yeah. Yeah. And we're on the opposite side of the fields. And I sure, just look. Of course. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> what the hell was yeah. that? Millie, get in the house. <laughs> nice pose. Like, she, like, she, like, she just like, like does like, like come on. <laughs> Yo, yeah. It's, I'll yeah, see you sleepy. <laughs> She, she she just gives you the look and then follows you wherever you're about to go. <laughs> Amelia, I said get in the house. Carl, Carl. <laughs> yeah, no, so um, yeah, I'm gonna I'm just gonna look at you and I'm gonna go like Fine. Five feet back from behind me. Fingers over your ears anytime I pull the trigger. Fine. And then like I'm gonna come around the corner real slow with the gun drawn. Mm-hmm. And, and she's just, not five feet away from you. She's yeah, quite yeah. close to you. <laughs> Robbie takes a second to be like, if I trip backwards right now, she's going to hold me. <laughs> <laughs> and then he like shakes his head and he's like, no, oh, there's, there's fucking wrestlers right now. And I have to go counter wrestle. Mm-hmm. So um, yeah, I guess I'm going to, I'm, you know, I think we're gonna come around the corner, and like you, we just see like, ugh. <laughs> like what used yeah. to definitely be a cow, but like, yeah, yeah. It's, it's we gross. find yeah. we find half of a cow. Sure. Oh yeah, yeah. And like scorch marks, and I just look at it and I go, Amelia, huh? what the actual Jesus Christ riding a goddamn bicycle fuck happened here? And she's like a little speechless, and then she's just like looking at like the half charred carcass of a cow. Amelia, get away from that! That is disgusting and gross, and a lady like you should not be so close to blood and gore. What? What? What the heck did this? Wonder. Wonder. Use the wonder. (laughs) Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Wonder. Um, yeah, I'm gonna put my wonder. Um, so. Look, this this whole last week has just been way too crazy. You cannot just sit there and tell me that a woman shouldn't be doing something like this. Is it? Did, yeah. And he like just stops for a second, and, like he just kind of like looks down at the ground and sighs. <sighs> Millie, you bring up a very, very good point. I apologize. <laughs> I respect your decision to want to assist in this matter. And then he like he hear he hear like a twig snap off in the distance and just fires off like three rounds at it. <laughs> but, like, he's in the middle of conversation. He's like, Amelia, I totally understand, but Yeah, like the, the first one shoots off and she like in, like just like 
puts her hands over her ears because it's like super freaking loud and like yeah yeah and then um, i think he just kind of le- leans over and goes now that was one of two things a squirrel or whatever did this i'm hoping it was the second one <laughs> but it was probably the probably Amelia, now is not the time for this <laughs> Um, so do we have a question yet? I think the question is like, can we, do we like, do we discover what it was? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. sure. Cool. Yeah, so I'm about to push open the bush as we're about to make the roll. Like, yeah. Uh-huh. yeah. All right. Make the roll. Make the roll. Okay. I'm rolling two dice plus the asset. Um, um, so two for you plus the asset plus the participant. So you got four dice. Versus three. Well, you know, uh, I'm well known for rolling. Jason, or, if you want to roll verse three, uh, what you can do is just hit the up arrow, and it has the uh, it copies your uh, last roll. Oh, hey, that's it. I subscribe to this idea. <laughs> Woo hoo! Yes. All right. Danger by one. I just push up the bush to the dragon. I did it. <laughs> My goddamn hero. Yeah, no, maybe so we, I, see, maybe oh, we well, see like. Uh, I, I think I, we see. I have a suggestion. I see, sure. I well, I think we find the other half of the cow. <laughs> oh or yeah. Like, like that's like been like partially eaten or whatever, right? Yeah. Like, like you, like you, like you shot and it like spooked it, so it dropped it or whatever. And yeah, no, I think it. I was gonna say and we or, find, or like you we know, find, we find part half the other half of the cow. And I'm like, damn it, Betty. <laughs> I should have been in the barn. Herman was supposed to take you yeah, into the right, barn last some, night, and Herman oh, decided oh, oh, wait, to take I've, you into the bar. Right. Okay, yeah, so you're like you, you you're looking at the other half of the cow and then you feel me tap on your shoulder and then like I point and we look up and like this where the tree yeah. line was yeah. and there's this huge hole in the tree line <laughs> where it flew away. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, I just, and as the scene fades, like you know, we kinda do the swooping motion, I just lean over and go, Amelia, I think I'm gonna need a bigger gun. <laughs> <laughs> nice. Awesome. <laughs> Love it. So, and since, then just the sound of reloading. <laughs> <laughs> so since you do have technically uh, two uh, two uh, character points at this point, do you want to spend them towards a third die, or do you want to save them for later? I can use character points on a third die, or spending them to bring in assets or locations. Yep, later on. Yeah. Um, did I get Did I get uh, two for spending my wonder? Yep. Okay. Cool. Uh, I will. And that, that specific wonder card is now exhausted. It is gone. You don't wonder about Robert no more. Nope. <laughs> it's a shame. Um, I'm gonna I'm gonna keep the points. Okay, sounds good. And I guess it is my turn. I am going to. I think I'm also gonna go towards the danger. Um, I am the one who knocks. Always mm-hmm. run towards danger. Um, let's see, I am going to go with. Um, I think I'm going to bring Herman into this, and um, it's going to take place on the farmstead. So I will spend one of my character points, and I am going to say that the question is. Do hmm, do we find uh, do we do we see a dragon? That's that's the question. I'm I'm going I'm going direct. Do we see the danger? Yeah, okay. I'm thinking it's gonna it's it's taking place about the same time as what you guys just went through, um, but it's on another part of the farmstead. So we heard. The, the the sounds and then the gunshots mm-hmm. and um, uh, we're going to uh, meaning, say this. meaning Herman knows that I'm with his daughter just <laughs> <laughs> so it, this could together. be um... <laughs> and uh, I think I think we're actually in the fields like maybe uh, Herman you were teaching me uh, like a now that I'm old enough to do some basic work you're teaching me some something out in the field uh, is, it, uh, is it nighttime um I th- 
was it nighttime for yours? I thought it was like, was it dusk or day or night? It was, it's like the sun was, it was real nice and romantic. We were watching the sunset. Oh, sure, sure. Yeah, wait. Yeah, it's going wait, 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 sorry, okay. sorry, sorry. I mean, I mean, Herman, Herman. Nothing romantic. Uh, just friends. <laughs> just buds. <laughs> just go to You know, you were bringing That's in what equipment. I thought. <laughs> I mean, I'm the one with the pistol right now, so I mean. Yeah, let's uh, let's say that we're bringing in equipment, um, and uh, actually, uh, I'm gonna say that uh, Robbie said that it would be really nice if I volunteered to help bringing in the equipment this time uh, because it would show that I'm a, I'm a big boy. <laughs> 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 so of course, I wanted to be dutiful and helpful. Oh, absolutely. That was that was my sole intention. I am trying to make you into a strong young man. I appreciate that. Be a wingman, real young. <laughs> <laughs> so uh yeah we're we're out in the field uh collecting uh collecting tilling equipment and uh we hear that kind of the rending sound and then the gunshots uh what i yeah what was that i immediately like like brace you and and like just instinctively like push you to the ground right Ooh. as i like i like look up around i'm like don't move son you know, like, or I, but like, or don't move, kid. Right? You know, mm. like, what? What was that? I don't know. Some kind of airplane. Um, I, I don't hear, I don't hear anything now. What? Be the weirdest was, airplane. Was those be gunshots? That sure as rain. Or uh, you know, like, <laughs> uh, <laughs> I definitely. So, like, yeah, it was definitely definitely but well, I, I just keep like looking at the sky to see like what what was going on there it's like all right you you okay i, I am I, I, I lift you up Wait, uh do you think they're after do you think they're after duke from now what what would come from the sky after duke don't be silly that's <laughs> i Air, air it was man. probably some kind of bird. <laughs> it was a, maybe it was an angry so, giant it was bird. Probably, it was probably Joe out hunting on our and under the woods back there, just like he like always does. Maybe I'm just gonna have to go up next time and and tell him about it. He probably yeah. thought he could do it because we gave it's just a good deal on that steak. No, nah, but what about the noise before the guns? That that couldn't have been no bird, and that that wasn't no Joe. That was that was, that Listen. sounded like a big a big a big. A really hey, big. Get your head out of the clouds. My my head is perfectly in a reasonable height for a person of my age. You are not thinking of the possibilities. Possibilities. <laughs> is that you playing your wonder on him? Yeah, I'm, yeah. I'm wondering. Yeah, and, and I'm I've been I've been totally playing the reason on you like this whole time. <laughs> yeah. Counter cards. Counter cards. Look, Throw the cards everywhere. I know we've been having a pretty crazy week around here, but we have Duke. Duke was here, and and then there was the the, the the point where I saw I saw the I saw the that he he can't fly, but I'm I'm guessing at some point he will. And then there was he's there was not that gonna fly. Wait, look at me! Stop! What? Stop! What? Look at me! What? He's not gonna fly. He's just some lizard you got from the carnival. No, I, I understand. Old enough. He can't We're gonna fly. let him go. Yeah. And it's going to be the end of it. Well, he he will fly, and and when he flies, it. Wait, what if what if it was his uncle? That's what it was. We heard. Maybe he's looking for Duke. Lizards ain't people. They don't have uncles. <laughs> well, this ain't. They don't no have no family lizard. connections like that. This ain't no normal. What do you think lizard? this is? This is a- this is it is awesome, a normal lizard. It's just some weird awesome one, probably from Europe. Lizard. It's a danger lizard, and it's gonna fly. I know it will. I know it will, Herman. Danger lizard. I stop. I storm towards the direction of the sound, and I will prove it. And then I stop. Ze- and look back is- at you. Ezekiel, you get back here right now. If you if you make Amelia wait even one gosh darn minute for she's ma- you know what she's making tonight for dinner. She's making your favorite. She's what? making spaghetti. 
You get you get your butt out of here, and you apologize to me. And you, when you get home, you apologize to Amelia. No, no, we're gonna go. I I I I chase after you and grab you by your earlobe and like pull you back. You know, like come on, let's go, let's go. I'm running now. Oh, oh, you okay? So I have to like chase after you. Yeah. Oh, you break off from me, like, gosh darn it! I'm going. Ezekiel Wilkins. I'm gonna prove it, Mr. You're gonna, Kellogg. you're gonna, you're gonna get a whooping. You're gonna get a whooping. You're, you know, you're not, no, gonna, you're not gonna forget. No. You're making, making, making Herman, oh, oh, you know, making old Herman run. And, and obviously, I can like, I'm gonna outrun you and, and get you unless you like do something, you know, like duck between trees or like slide down something in the place I can't get to you. I'm, um, I'm and then we the, get yeah uh, the corn stalks. Yeah. As, oh, know, okay, okay. Yeah, you're gonna lose me in the corn stalks or whatever, right? Oh okay. yeah, 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 yeah. But yeah, yeah. I'm still yelling like when I think I yeah. lose you, I'm yelling to kind of keep you going. Cause I yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 <laughs> All right. Yeah. So we're we're running through the stalks and stuff. We're like you know we we have that scene. It's kind of like signs. You know, like we're like running <laughs> through this stuff. Um, and what do we see? That's a yeah. good question. Time to roll. Let's find out. So let's see. Uh, two for me. One for you. I have another four. Um, let's see. Boop. This will be 46. One versus... Am I rolling three? Yeah. No, I'm rolling two, right? Because don't isn't the uh, danger two less? Oh, no, no, no. It's every scene's three. It's every, every independent of the danger. Right okay, that's right. One. Woo, even. So that's, but you win. No success, though. So... Awesome. We uh we break through. I break through the uh, the corn uh, the corn stalks right into the open area, where um, I think at this point uh, the two of you are still there, kind of like surveying the area, and you're able to kind of catch up with me, and I I kind of look around, and I'm like, look look it's a it's a corpsey thing. It's a dead it's a dead livestock. And I I, I say. Aw, oh, shit, that's Bessie. Get get away from there. Get away from there, kids. Get away. As like, oh. we got... Yeah, no, I'm... If, if I'm it's allowed to scene... talk to your guys' scene, yeah. I'm not letting Zeke come over here either. Yeah. Or either. Like, like, you and I for once yeah. agree. Yeah, no, like, like we see that... It's like that scene where the, the half-animal or whatever is like... Mm -hmm. It's like in a shadow silhouette, kind of like in the front of the scene, and it's like on the... Like, you know, it's like on the ground... The camera's on the ground, like, tilted up, and like, you see, like, me kind of like holding my arm, like, keeping you guys back. Like, let's get out of here, kids. You know, let's get back. Come on, no, we gotta go. It's, it's gotta be around here. It's it's gotta. And at that point, a uh, a thick chunk of viscera kind of plops to the ground as we pass underneath one of the trees. Ugh. And as yeah. you look up, you see like this this body of a not necessarily a grand epic D and D dragon, but one long enough that it's rusting across the boughs of the top of the tree, mm, just yeah. dropping over the guts. Yeah. I'm like, ah, I see it. I, I say it as loud as I can. I yeah. told you. I told you. And it starts looking towards us. And that's where I think I'm going to cut the scene. Yeah, that's the scene. Yeah. <laughs> Perfect scene. Perfect scene. <laughs> cool. Awesome. Nice. Now it's our scene. I wonder what scene you're going to choose. Do we, do we all do two, so we, we all do two scenes for this first part? Correct. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Um,. I mean, oh, and actually, uh, since I've got uh, chips or points to spare, I'm actually going to spend two of mine and get my third uh, hope die. So now I'm chock full of hope. I am the hope king. All the hope. I'm going. I'm I'm tripling down on hope, literally. <laughs> okay, so you have three hope dice. Um... All right. Oh, yeah. So I, I have to read the rules for the scenes to know which ones work with different people then for this scene um so obviously the scene will be with the danger wait what happened so we got you tied with one success so we won that scene but that's, does that change the danger pool at all or anything like that uh it it reduces the danger by one um and uh that, that's pretty much it right now yeah <laughs> okay so we're down to one on the pursuer and one on the uh danger but we got none on the secret yeah yeah we yeah. need to yeah so this I mean, you're, you're totally baiting me into doing that next scene, but I think we might. I might want to do a flashback scene to help the secret yeah. out right now. Go for Dreams, it. dream yeah. sequence. 
So I think I think we're gonna do. Yeah, that's what I think I'm gonna do. I think I'm I think I'm gonna have uh, another scene. Uh, can I spend a die to have another someone else in the scene as well? Yes, uh, you get one for free, and then you can bring in anybody you want for one uh, one point each. Yeah, so I'm gonna spend one point here, and I'm going to grab uh, I'm gonna grab uh, Robert as well. So it's gonna be uh, Robert, Zeke, and me okay. uh, together. And I think um, the question that I want to know is, um, wait, I guess that that has to be a yes or no question. Mm -hmm. Um, I was going to, okay. Um, obviously, um, obviously Duke has escaped. Mm -hmm. That makes sense. And we have to go track him down. So the question is, can we, can we find Duke? Okay. Cool. And this is a, this is a flashback you said? Yeah, this is a flashback scene. This won't be in, in, in the room at the same time. So or, we know it in. Yes. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I think so. Um, That's fine. I'm okay with that. <laughs> no, I'm sorry. It's not. I, I was just thinking about it a little bit. Sorry I got stuck in my head a little bit. I was thinking, no, it's not. This is actually a continuation of the scene. Uh, we, we chase down the dragon, right? So, like, what happens is... When I, I don't, I'm not going to worry that much about setup, but, like, we chase down the dragon. The dragon goes to the barn. It tries to find Duke, and Duke's not there. And now we don't know where he's going. And now that thing flew off, and now we are trying to find Duke. Okay? Like, yeah. That's where we're at. Okay? So now we have to hunt down Duke. Yeah, um, and then maybe like Amelia goes to the house in case to, to yeah, search the to house. Yeah, to the exactly. house. Exactly. Exactly. Yeah. Exactly. Plus, um, I don't think Herman or I want you out here with yeah. the goddamn and dragon. I'm going to spend... Yeah. Uh, also, spend I don't want Zeke out here, but... I'm going to spend in the other one for the flatbed truck. So we're all oh, getting nice. in the truck. Nice. And so we're, it's going to be one of those scenes where like we're driving around and we have like the headlights on because it's evening now. Uh, you know, or like just starting to get evening, so the lights are on, and we're gonna be running through like the driving off road stuff looking for Duke. Okay, so uh, you know, we're yeah, we're, we're like looking for signs of Duke, um, looking around, and um, yeah, so I think, I think we're should the scene be like an immediate thing, like uh, I don't know, I need help here, um. How, so, like, I set up all the details here. How should the scene actually begin? Mm. Um, um, we see a sign of Duke somewhere, like, and we're questioning whether or not it's actually a sign of him. Well, uh, I think I think it could start even before that. It starts with us realizing that you fit two people on the front of the truck, and one person has to be in the back, and I'm getting in the back of the truck. Okay. Yeah, I think because so. I think it can just be start off with the like you and me both trying to get no, it's it's you and me going to the truck like after putting Zeke and Amelia in the house. Mm-hmm. And then I'm and, like, and then, no 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 we open the door to the truck and you're like ah and Zeke yeah and Zeke's in the <laughs> that sounds good it's it's like it's like the like every 80s 90s yeah exactly every, exactly, like, exactly. Like, oh, and there's no time in the back seat yeah and we don't have to around so he's there all right um, so boy how are we gonna even find him maybe that's how we start like we're driving like art right, so how are we gonna even look for him. Mm. And then, and then we hear from behind us, Dick, Dick. Exactly. Dick. Zeke, what the? Zeke, what are you doing in this truck? Well, we're yeah. looking for Duke, ain't we? God, I thought Amelia took you inside. What are you doing out I here? I thought you took him inside. I, I've I thought you it. took him inside. <laughs> as you know, as we're like, you know, flooring, like we hear the revving of the engine accelerate. Yeah, yeah. You know. I'm just looking for him. God, your your mother's gonna be pissed, <laughs> you know. So you're just trying to, <laughs> and uh, find him. Poor dude. Oh my God, everybody's gonna get pissed. <laughs> <laughs> Zeke, I understand you want to help find Duke, but here's the thing: scream, yeah. Duke. It's gonna make him more scared. <laughs> Zeke, Zeke, Duke is not a dog. Zeke. Duke is not a dog. He doesn't respond when you call his name. The, the the thing doesn't even know it has a name, and I don't, I don't know why we're hunt. I, 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 uh, but I miss him. So like I, yeah. So I think I think we have a scene where um I think like we all right the scene kind of progresses a little bit. I think we the scene have a scene. It's kind of like uh. 
kind of like the beginning part of of No Country for Old Men. Like the trucks like parked at <laughs> the hill or like whatever. There's like the More lights are on. More like, references I don't get. The lights, the lights are on like overlooking the thing, and but now we're like kind of like on foot, um, mm-hmm. and like. I like the idea that like Zeke somehow is like holding like a like a steak or something like that to try to get, yeah. to get the attention. <laughs> he grabbed it from inside the house before he yeah. left. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, we we could say that uh, we found like, like some sort of like small animal track since he doesn't fly yet. <laughs> yeah. Oh yeah, yeah, that's a really good point. Yeah. Um, since I was brought into the scene, do I have to spend a character point to have my dad's service pistol on me? Uh. Did we bring? Uh, we only ha- we only get one prop per scene, and he brought the flatbread flatbread <laughs> in. <laughs> I did the same thing I did, right? <laughs> yeah, because it's, oh, yeah, it's gonna be a like, great sandwich. Of, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so um, I'll throw the bullets at. It, don't worry. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So I'm um, seek. Seek. Once we find this, once we find this lizard, this is it. We're done with this. We're going. We're we are what? we're going. Once we get this lizard, we're gonna we're gonna give him back to the carnival. This is gonna be it. No, no, he's our he's our pet. He's our friend. He's not I a would. pet. He is I not would. some dog, Zeke. He's a lizard. And then what? And then what, Herman? Herman, and then what? It's a yeah. wild animal. Yeah, Herman, Herman. Be reasonable. Herman. There is no reason here. There is no godforsaken reason here. Think about what happens. We give back we give back the dragon to the carnival. You know what happens? Carnival burns down. All the kids that go to the carnival get eaten by a goddamn dragon. Herman? So you have two choices. We can fix this. We can go through with this. Hell, we're going to have to listen to Zeke on this. Or we can go find him, or we can let him run around, and more people can get hurt, Herman. So if you want to choose the coward way out and let people get hurt, as opposed to fixing our mistake, granted, it is a mythological beast mistake, it's but not some mistake. mythological beast. What the hell have you been reading? This is a lizard. It's just some kind of European lizard, and that's it. Did you? So I understand that you weren't. Uh, you were. You were out hiding when I was uh, trying to protect your daughter from being uh, eaten by uh, something that I saw with my own eyes. Um, just thought I'd throw it out there. Um, I shot it. I saw it. It wasn't red blood. You saw yeah, it. Did- it was in the tree. Tell me, what type of European lizard is about? Did you hit it? Yeah, did you, I did. Three you times. didn't kill it? Yeah, exactly why we should be scared, Herman. No, that's exactly why you should give me that goddamn gun, because if you're anything like your father, you would got the job done. Hand over. First of all, over my dead body. <laughs> Second of all, I think someone's going to play a fear. <laughs> <laughs> I just I have that sneaking suspicion that a fear is about to be played. I mean, it's I, not my fear. Play. I already played the your fear previously. Oh, okay. Yeah. <laughs> I, I, I think I it again. So I think yeah. Um, at this point, uh, no, I'm just I'm. If the, the if the car is even remotely slow enough for me to get out of the car, I'm out of the car. Yeah, we already were out of the car. Yeah. Oh, okay. Well, then I'm we're just gonna be out. like, I just look at you and be like, you are not, and you will never be a fifth of a man that my father was and don't you dare ever ever use his name again and you watch your goddamn tongue in front of me because i'm twice the man you could ever hope to be in any of your goddamn dreams and then i walk into the woods by myself okay well i think you inadvertently stumble upon uh where duke is hiding um i think duke- <laughs> and then i'm just like pissed off and anger. i'm like and there's a goddamn dragon motherfucker duke, yeah <laughs> I think I think I think Duke Duke might have been well. I think we have to roll, right? Don't we actually yeah. have to roll for that part? So this will be whether or not Duke is actually there. Mm. He might be like in a stream or something, like eating a fish. Um, I'm like sitting we'll down, see. pissed off, and he starts <laughs> nudging me in the head. <laughs> yeah, or he like he's like in like some roots or something nah. like that, right? Um, near 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 like a gulch and some kind of like you know creek. Yeah, with the what do you call it? what do you call it? ravine? Is it a ravine? Um, you know, like how like farms have like that like creek or whatever that runs through them, and there's always freaking trees that grow on the side of it. What yeah, do you call that? Like I just a, call it a creek. Yeah, creek. Yeah, I, I know it's like yeah, it's a, it's a creek, but like I don't know what the, the actual term next to it. Yeah, yeah, right. But like yeah, like yeah. it's it might be in like the the roots of something like that. Maybe we'll we'll see. So um, let's see. So, so the danger rolling. got two successes. This is, this is a hope dice though. This is a hope dice thing. So both of you factor in hope dice. 
So yep. that's four so, days. Uh, truck is five days. Well, so um, so Herman, you don't have any. We only can bring one. Since we're participating, we can only bring one in each. So that's two from oh. us. Oh, so it's just two then. Yeah. And but two. like you said, you got uh, the, uh, the did... uh, flatbed. That's three. Yeah. But I do get two dice for, for bringing in the reason for... for um. Uh, well, you get two character oh. points that you can you can spend later. Oh, I can't spend that right now for a die? It's no. After. Okay, got it. Got it. Okay. Uh, so then I'm at only at two dice. Oh, uh, three. Three dice. Three. So that's near, nearly as good as I thought it was going to be. Okay. Um, you better roll okay. like a goddamn so, champion. So three versus three? Yep. I got two successes. Ah, oh. oh. but at least um, it can't go any lower. <laughs> nah, that is that is actually less. All right. Well, that's still a fun scene. So he's not there then. <laughs> um, also, well, we see a sign of something worse that something might have taken him. Um, also, maybe we see a bear trap. Oh, <laughs> setting up the pursuer. <laughs> we, see, we see a clown. because well, don't though. don't we up the pursuer? Isn't that what we do when this happens? Um, so the pursuer will go up if we fail on a pursuer roll. Oh, oh so, but we fail. No, we do the secret roll this time. Yeah, we did the secret oh, roll. It would have. We would have lost. Uh, we would have lost uh, one, except for the fact that secret's already yeah. at zero and you can't. Oh, see, I, I know. I thought. I thought secret when it lost something, another one went up. I'm sorry. No, That's no, 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 no. Okay, cool. <laughs> Perfect. Thanks. No problem. So I gain another two character points for the uh, wonder thing as well, right? Yep. You spent your wonder there. Yeah, dude. I spent wonder on nice. Herman. So you get that the first time for each of your cards. Oh, you only get it. You only get it to spend that one time. Okay, then I've already used my reason for Zeke, and then I should not have had that. So I don't actually don't get my two character dice there. Ah, gotcha. But you can. I mean, you obviously can role play it out more. But uh, yeah, you only get the uh, the character I point. I don't have a bond with um with Robert, despite him being in both of my scenes. There's some drama. Drama. Oh, no. Going on. Yeah, no. There's absolutely no bonding going on. Yeah. <laughs> Uh, and if someone can drag me the two, I can't actually drag the uh, the character things. Oh, yeah, I got you. I got your two dice. Yeah. Oh, and... yeah. Right. That, that's that's Amelia. That's Amelia. <laughs> Gosh, that's Amelia, Jay. What are you doing? What are you doing, dragging that dice there, Jay? I can't help it. Classic like Jay. Screen. Classic Jay. <laughs> that does sound like a Jay thing to do. You <laughs> got two left. If you wouldn't mind dragging uh, dragging two over to Zeke. Yes. Thank you very much. Yeah. <laughs> Woohoo. Okay. Um <clears throat> Does it Tux Tridamus's uh his. his it tis. Uh so I think I we actually haven't seen the pursuer a lot, and I think I would like to try to get that dice that little that one the one in the pool to go away. Get that last mm. one gone? Yeah, because uh, we're not doing so well in the secret. So if we can bring down the pursuer, I feel it's the same thing. <laughs> no, we're saying we with the secret. Um, so I think I would like to, uh, for my, I would like to. Uh, so my the character I'd like to bring in is uh, Herman. Um, I would like to spend one of mine to use the carnival. Uh, and then I would also like to spend one to use my school bag. Nice. Okay. Multi-purpose. Yeah. Um, so you spend three dice? Uh, two, because you, you, I, I get you for free. Oh, you get me for free. That's right. That's right. Thank you. Yeah, um, yeah I get you for free. Uh, yeah, so I think you guys like you guys didn't find him and then came back. And so it's like the morning of the next day. Aren't you oh. still spending two because you got the carnival and the book bag, though? Yes. Yes. Yeah. They did, they, he had three dice to begin with. Okay, so uh, um, don't mind me. <laughs> You're good. Okay. Um, yeah, so I think it's like it's like the morning of the next day, and so we're going out to look for him again. Um, I think maybe like during the night, I like pulled out a bunch of books and started reading them and stuff, and like found some sort of like fairy tale or whatever where like a dragon returned to like a place that it knew about, and so like we got like like since we have no idea where to look for him, where I like I came up with the idea like maybe we should go, maybe he went back to the carnival or something, and uh, so. Like Herman took me to the carnival so we can go try to see if it like went back there or something like that. Um, but this is like the morning, so it's like closed. Maybe like, is this sleeping? like before things are open? 
or like is when, what time of the day is it oh yeah i guess it would be that could be that could be interesting too if it's like kind of if it's like not open yet but we still get in to oh, try like and find them in yeah or something like that like scooby doing it yeah, yeah. Scooby <laughs> doing it. yeah of course we're snoop yeah 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 we're definitely scooby doing this sweet yeah um yeah so we get there on like the 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 empty carnival with like the do, like the the dew of the morning still fresh on like the the fence and all the grass and everything, um, and we're kind of like around the back or something like near one of the gates, and uh, as so I like look up at you and then look at like the gate like it's closed. What should, what what should we do? I um I go to the truck because like it's not an asset. I just we came here in the truck, right? Mm-hmm. And I like pull out like a like a monkey wrench or something like that and I just like hit the lock really hard <laughs> and it breaks and it's like don't uh yeah. Um like uh, I, saying, I, I say I mean I I say something like don't let it, you know like um pre- pretend you didn't see this, right? <laughs> you know. <laughs> and then Dude, I I hold the gate for you. Right? Yeah, I think Amelia like she like smirks and then like step yeah, slips in and then uh they go to look around yeah um uh and so yeah i think we're walking and then um i i, I probably pull out the book again to like just to make sure i got it right like yeah I, I, don't, I don't know i guess he might be here but i kind of hope he's not me too me too and we like look around uh we pull back some like curtains or something you know for like 10 flaps of different things mm-hmm. uh, um, no sign i think i would like to uh i'd like to help you out so i'm going to as we're walking um i'm going to give like a little <coughs> <coughs> oh yeah so um yeah so uh boy how do i incorporate that though um I guess I guess probably the the, the number one question is like I like pull you aside while we're walking is like, how long have you had that cough? It's it, it's it, I'm fine. Sure doesn't sound fine. No, it's 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 okay. I it's just it's just I, I probably caught a cold from being out all night. I like I use I use suspiciously. I like, look up like probably shouldn't have said that either. Like uh, <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> I, I mean I mean I just we we we're, were looking for Duke, you know. It, it, like Zeke's probably Zeke's probably sneezing up a storm. Okay, so uh, here's a question. So like mechanically, uh, the, in, the uh, Tux has an insecurity about this. Mm-hmm. Uh, the bad cough sounds like how our mom's sickness started. So the Got way it. I can can I like invoke that? by saying something to the effect of um like let me know if this gets any worse or whatever cuz he's like you know that's this is how it all started with mom right like is that like mm-hmm. how it should work cuz even though it's not like i'm bringing it to public attention and, and that kind of thing uh it 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 can it's it's specifically uh flexible so you can kind of okay. add it as, as you feel appropriate yeah. okay. um but it is definitely something that should um when it's played, it's definitely a, would be a concern then for Amelia. Like, oh, uh, uh, yeah. you brought it up, you know, it's, yeah, it's okay, yeah, the anxiety from it, yeah, yeah, okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. So, uh, yeah, I just I hold you like you're, you know, hands on your shoulders, whatever. It's like, listen, like that cough sounded like what mom had, you know. Be careful, right? Let me know if it gets any worse. Oh, and, um, um, yeah, yeah, okay. I know. I like I like nod at you, and I like um. I like do some kind of like father daughter thing about like your hair, or, like move it out of the way, or you know, like or like like yeah, like yeah. boop you on the nose, or you know, some kind of like affection thing that I've done your entire life. Mm-hmm. Um, okay, and and then be like, all right, now let's go find Duke. And um, yeah, I tell you, um, I look at you and I tell you that, um, look, you think you think those those stories or whatever about this thing, you think this is a dragon, but. I'm I'm not convinced yet. I still think it's I still just think that it's a uh, just some some fancy ass lizard. And, Dad. And a thing or two I know about lizards is that they like to get someplace warm. So where do you think this carnival would still be warm? 
I look over, like I can't look maybe like we're like behind a tent or something. I look around and look over to like the like this is like a teachable it. moment. Like I'm teaching you to think this way, right? Yeah, so yeah, like yeah. you, like I, I like I know yeah, the yeah, answer. Teaching me to use reason exactly. as a player. I'm asking you to tell me where we're going, but as a character, it's like, oh, I already know this thing. I'm teaching you this. Okay, but anyways, yeah, yeah. So and, it's like um, maybe it's like a little bit of, like like it's since, since it's kind of getting towards fall, I mean, it's like it's a little chilly around like yeah, around yeah. here. But I look over to like I'm not sure if it's called the caravans or whatever, but like like the kind of like because like when the traveling circus or whatever they have like all the stuff from like the, the tents, but then they also have like the logistics, like, the, the homes or whatever that, that, that they, yeah. they what, what they stay in when they're, the when logistics. They're there. Yeah. Of, yeah, of they, they have, like, yeah, yeah. The, like the mobile the, homes, basically yeah, the mobile homes, essentially trailers, and, like, basically. Yeah. That's probably, so there's probably like, 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 like trailers and a few of like the, that they sleep in. Yeah. Like, and there's like a fire going over there or something like that. Like my point, like, well, there's a fire over there where they're, where everybody's sleeping. All right, let's be careful. And uh, we, we, we sneak over there. Um, yeah, I think we're ready for for dice. Yeah. So I guess the question is, is Zeke here? Yeah. And then, yeah. So let's see. You got to die for a location for being a carnival. Yeah. So I have one responsibility. Um, I have one from you, uh, one for my school bag, and one for the carnival. Sounds right. Four dice. Oh. Forty-six greater than four. Boop. Whoa. Three. Hey. Ah. Oh, Nine, tie, so we get it though. Yay. So we decrease pursuer by one, right? Yes. Mm-hmm. So, so that 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 can work out right. Like, the the question we want can be no, also, right? Mm-hmm. Okay. Good. Yeah. 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 So yeah so like, maybe, like, question. So yeah, I think we like we sneak over there. Um. Uh, there's probably a couple like. Cl- really close moments where like we like are like poking around one of the like one of the trailers and like you like put your arm up and like someone walks by or whatever and then like we walk around a little bit more but like, we spend like a while but then we like we don't see we don't see zeke there um and then we get get away and then like i don't i don't i don't think he's here where could he yeah and we sit you know we're, we're driving away and be like where did that damn lizard overgrown lizard get and, and that's <laughs> it right we cool. the next one okay Awesome. Cool scene. Nice. Uh, yeah. So was that did that end in a success or no? Yes. Yeah. So, we, uh, we we brought the pursuer down by uh yeah, Zeke wasn't Zeke what they didn't find him and Zeke wasn't there, so Okay. Or, uh, Duke? Or me? Duke. Yeah, you meant Duke. You meant Duke. Yeah, no, sorry. Yeah, sorry. I, yeah, I well, Zeke Zeke also was not there. Right. Um, so, that, that's for later when they kidnap Zeke and we have to trade them. There you go. <laughs> <laughs> I have to come back to that decision. Um, actually, so I didn't realize that the character points had to be spent at the end of the scene. And I retroactively spend two points to add something. Okay. Just because I totally didn't realize. Because <laughs> wide awake. Um, I'd actually like to add another one, to, another reason die. Okay, so you're chock full of reason. There's enough hope to get me back. <laughs> that costs two. Yes. Uh, yep. Okay. So it's not two to spare. Cool. Yep. And at the end of that scene, um, I'm cashing in my reasoning with Amelia for two character dice. Nice. So, got that down. Okay. Sounds good. Speaking. Of reasoning with Amelia. <laughs> I, actually, I'm not going to... Uh. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to go out to the Seeker with, uh, with my little brother. Nice. Yeah, and um, for... And anyone can use anyone else's assets, right? Yep. Yeah. Uh, then I'm going to spend a point to have uh, the flatbed truck. <laughs> nice. <laughs> the truck, nice. <laughs> yeah. So I'm going to spend a point to uh, have uh, Herman's truck. Uh, Herman, we'll discuss it later. <laughs> I think it's. Um, you know what? You know what? I'm going to spend both of my points. I'm going to bring. Um, I'm going to bring Amelia too. Okay. Oh man, it's youth on patrol. 
that's that, that's what this is all about and, I mean, <laughs> and, yeah we're, we're going after the secret i need all the hope i got and no offense herman you you don't you know i got much <laughs> uh, don't worry we've been we've been doing enough together yeah i got it <laughs> yeah, no, the first let's the cool first down season. a little bit yeah take a breather <laughs> i'm just gonna start fighting you in real life i swear to god <laughs> you're not my fictional character's fictional daddy <laughs> Um, yeah, no, so, um, we're still looking for Duke, and, um, no, I think, I think, because we, we failed that scene where we were all in the truck last time, so, I think it's, like, 3 a.m., Herman maybe hit the sauce, maybe doesn't hit the sauce, I don't know, if you did that, Eric? Um, you, you. Uh, I do, I do when it's bad. It, is it bad? Yeah, but well, you just yeah. You, it, this is probably the same thing that you got back from with that. So you're thinking about that. So yeah, yeah. So Herman's not waking up. Yeah, yeah. Herman's doing his thing, and then we're all just like, we need to find, we need to find Duke. I, I think it's less of that and more of a you all hear the truck start. Oh, okay, cool. <laughs> yeah. So it's real quiet, and I just like Herman ain't gonna wake up, and then you just hear, and I'm like. Me failing to pop the clutch on the first round, just be like, God damn, fucking damn. <laughs> exactly, like, God damn, trucks. I don't like trucks. And then, um, I, so like, what, so is there like, were you, were you trying to like sneak out away from us too, or was it like a? Kind of, well, okay, I mean, so, yeah, I was gonna hey, say this, let's this, have, this, let's this, have this, and find out. Well, yeah, because I was gonna say this would be really a funny way to introduce us. So it'd be like you pop the clutch and like it, it shoots off and like you actually like shit shit and then it's like, like and then both of us just looking in the window. What are you doing in there? Zeke, go to bed. It's way too early for you to be awake right now. No, it's too late for me to be awake right now. Zeke, you bring up a great point. Go to bed. <laughs> <laughs> I climb into the back, the the flatbed of the truck. Like, Zeke, Zeke, you get inside the cab. You do not sit in the back of the truck. There is room. You are like two inches. You will not take up too much space. You get into the, and then like I realize that you just bugs bunny to me. <laughs> <laughs> God damn it, Zeke. <laughs> I climb then, through the back window into the cab. Okay. Yeah, so I, then, I, then I open it up and like. And you're here too. Oh, God. Mm-hmm. Yeah, yeah, I am. That was not meant to be a fan. Oh, God damn it. So where are we going? Well, apparently we're going out to the woods to see if we can't find that goddamn dragon. Heck yeah. Good. I got a good feeling about this. You always have a good feeling, Zeke. I do. It's part of my positive outlook. Maybe you, should, maybe, maybe you could do some of that, Robert. Mm-hmm. Oh. Robbie. Amelia makes a point, Robbie. Zeke? Yeah? I'm your older brother. <laughs> the law will not look down upon me if I whip your ass right now. Oh. Come on, Robbie. Zeke, I mean that as a joke. I love you. Jesus ah. Christ. You all need a, <laughs> you all need a fucking sense of humor. That I start driving the car down the like, <laughs> shitty dirt road. Yeah, and like the camera pans through the window at Herman, who like was like. <laughs> 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 I take the bone that he that uh, Duke usually likes out of the pocket, and you see me taking like a deep breath, like about to shout his name. <gasps> <laughs> What? I was just going to call for him. Okay, Zeke, I understand the concept and I appreciate your enthusiasm. I have his bone. You know what? That the great the dragons, you see, dragons are magic and they know when you have the bone, but if you scream loud, they can't hear you. Oh. So you got to, it messes with their, uh, their, yeah, I mean, uh, just kinda like their looking equilibrium. At it messes with their equilibrium in the water in their ears, so it, it causes their heads to get all jumbled. So you got to stay quiet while they're looking for the bone. Right. They can't and listen at the same time, Zeke, that is like second grade. Come on. I, I don't want to mess with their ear water. Yeah, you can't mess with their ear water, Zeke. It ain't good for them. <laughs> like, yeah, Amelia chuckles and like, looks out like, 
<laughs> to look, keep looking. Um, <laughs> Robbie makes awkward eye contact with you and then goes. <laughs> yep. Um, <laughs> sounds like uh, sounds like you're uh, a little nervous that I'm here. Nah, you know, maybe. Well, uh, sounds like uh, sounds like your insecurity is kind of coming out because you're nervous around girls. I'm not <laughs> good at talking to them. But they are just... <laughs> Robbie, why did your voice sound all funny? You know, Zeke, your voice sounds funny all the goddamn time. <laughs> your, your voice is as high as Amelia's right now. <laughs> Robbie just shakes his head and keeps driving. <laughs> Car speeds up a little bit. <laughs> <laughs> so like i think we're gonna pull up to the woods and then again i'm gonna be like ah and now let's get oh shit park first <laughs> get out of the car yep make sure you remember all the okay good there we go amelia Less uh, well, i've, seen, I've seen my daddy drive this plenty of times i know how to do all the things amelia i very much appreciate the assistance but can we please just go find this goddamn blue lizard <laughs> it's, a dra- it's a dragon but yeah sure I would classify dragon as a subclass of lizard, but you're the one in schooling, so you should know. <laughs> <laughs> like it's big uncle that we found, you know, oh has and eats things. I bet it's going to breathe fire. You, 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 Zeke, you shouldn't say that with a smile. Of course I can. It would be really neat to see. You see, like the mouth open up. It looked like a little barbecue pit inside. And then... I grab, I grab Amelia's shoulder as, as like I'm assuming Zeke is like just a little bit ahead of us and still talking. <laughs> and then his wings would all be like flappy flap, and I'd be like, oh what? Well. <laughs> I just kind of pull Amelia back, and I just go. When I get set on fire, and I am slowly fighting a dragon, mm. as I am slowly burning away into ashes, well, I want you to remember two things. What? No, not you, Zeke. I'm talking to Amelia. You're still rambling. Uh, <laughs> I want you to remember two things, Amelia. One, I want you to get my little brother to safety. And two, I goddamn told you so. This was about to goddamn happen. Okay? Well, ain't you melodramatic? I found a switch and I'm swinging around in the air. And then I realize that I'm like touching your shoulder. And I'm like, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> 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 Anyways, we should split up you and Zeke. Go look. <laughs> just so you know, just just for future reference, if I if I if I don't tell you not to touch my shoulder, it, it's okay to do that. <laughs> I'm gonna go search over there. Okay. <laughs> and he's like very like like walks off and like as he walks into this, and you hear like you hear like very again stage whisper. You hear like. Oh my god, I touched her shoulder. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe if I'm lucky, I get to see her ankles. Now, come on, I'm a good Christian boy. <laughs> <laughs> but no, so like, I think, so I guess, this, I guess the question, because I actually never stated the question is, do I find the damn dragon? <laughs> <laughs> Specifically the small one that I like, not the yeah, large one exactly. that wants to set me upon fire. <laughs> good old Duke. Yes, do yeah. I find the yes, Duke? Yes, okay. Do I find the Duke in Hazard? Yes, do I find that one? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so Rob probably, probably goes off on his own, and then I catch up with Zeke, and we're searching around, and then, yeah, yeah. Yeah, and, like, as we're about to roll, we're about, like, all somehow going to stumble. <laughs> yeah, 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 of course. So I get one from me, one from Amelia, three from my boy Zeke. Um, only, only one of mine. You, if I participate. Oh, because you you're bringing, because you're bringing in, not because it's you. Okay, so yep. three, and then one for the truck. Yep, quattro, and I don't speak two French. Come on. Successes on their side. Two successes on theirs. I believe. I believe. Yay! Oh, yay! We tied. Nice. <laughs> okay. Get one back for secret. The secret is a little more powerful. Yay! Yeah, that means we found the damn dragon. Yes, we did. Yes, we finally got him back. And you know what? You know what? You know what? Amelia and Zeke are like having this conversation, and like I like to. Uh, Robbie is like starting to get paranoid. Like he's just like, "Oh crap! What if Zeke starts talking? Does Zeke know I like her? Oh, I hope Zeke doesn't know I like her. He can't <laughs> save his goddamn life. Oh no! I'm oh I gotta go. I gotta turn around and go to make sure Zeke don't ruin the surprise. And as I turn around, just. Duke. Yeah. <laughs> like total anticlimactic, like no threat, just Duke's. Yeah. Like, 
<laughs> he just does the pug thing, and I'm like, Yuki, you son of a bitch. <laughs> How long have you been following me? And then I pick up, and I pick up the dragon and just shoulder it. Awesome. And just start walking back like, Zeke. I, I probably have some weird nickname for you at this point. I'm like, I'll figure it out later, but <laughs> insert nickname here. I just like, you know, it's like, Zeke, Amelia, uh, I, found, I found the Duke. You found oh, good. him? Yeah, I found uh, him. I knew you would. I take the bone out of my, my coveralls. I let him gnaw on it some more. He loves yeah. this bone. Yeah, yeah, he does. You're hey. the best brother ever. Damn right. <laughs> right. No, no, you so, say that. You say that, and I just don't respond. You just like I'm like looking to see if Amelia is like at all impressed. Yeah. Oh yeah, yeah. She's like she's 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 giving you a smile. <laughs> like, she like give a smile like they they they're proving nod, and then you give him a nod, and he just goes. <laughs> 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 so for my scene, I'm gonna go with. Uh, um, could you, uh, could, uh, Eric? Could you move two uh, points to my to my thing? Yes. Did Thank you, you spend uh, your? I um I used my uh, I did the insecurity for uh, Rob. I'm I'm, a, I'm nervous and talking to the lady folk. <laughs> <laughs> um, so was it maximum of three per skill or maximum of three in general? Three in general. Uh, okay. You get one extra die period. There, there goes my plan to become the best at everything. <laughs> <laughs> best around. <laughs> Nothing's ever going to keep me down. Thank you. <laughs> All right, I'm going to go with the the danger, um, and I'm actually going to do it as a as a uh, small montage. Um, so montage. Um, take a montage. <laughs> I'm going to have Herman there. So that'll be uh, my freebie. And the flatbed truck will be in my little tail. And the question is, um, can we find where the dragon, uh, where the dragons are from? Ooh. So as, uh, as uh, the sun starts rising and uh, I, I have, I have breakfast all a cook. For uh, for Herman, who is surprised to find me there, um, I I tell him I need to uh, I need to go to town because I, um, with the festival coming up, I need uh, I need a new uh, a new fancy shirt. But uh, <laughs> once we're in the car, I start uh, kind of like giving him like directions to a uh, a spot which uh, which bewilders him. And uh, we end up actually on the crick. And uh, actually, I'm gonna I'm gonna turn from a mon- montage into kind of a, a sit down moment. Um, and uh, with that, uh, uh, Herman, you're sitting next to me at the crick after this really crappy ruse because, of course, I never wear a nice shirt. <laughs> you know me, I'm Zeke. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and um, I. Uh, I, I, I have this kind of like awkward uh, like aura right now. Um, I don't seem to be able to look you in the eye, um, but um, I I kind of look over towards you, and um, I hand you a picture. It's a uh, rather faded picture of uh, you and uh, and my mama. And it was from inside the uh, inside the the flatbed truck. Oh yeah, yeah, it was in the glove compartment. Mm-hmm. Of course, totally. And uh, I uh, I kind of look down and then look over towards you. Um, how come you have how come you have this picture? What? How'd you how'd you get that picture? I uh, it fell out of the truck. That's what were you doing in the truck without me? I it, it um it fell fell out outside of the truck uh, from the glove compartment. I don't know where it came from in there. Get um give me that picture and I like I like strongly grab it out of your hands and like we look at it and like the camera zooms in on it right and then like zooms in on like my face looking at it and I'm like my lip kind of like quivers a little bit you know like and. Uh, 
It's a long story. Well, um, unrelated to the truck, uh, Duke came home yesterday, so I've got time. That's good. Oh, you got you got your uh, got your lizard dragon. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well, look, you're you're getting to be about that age. And oh, oh, is this about the facial hair stuff? I, I know. No, about no, no. It's, this is a little bit different. This, oh. is, this is different than that, though. Okay. But this is just more general talk. Oh, okay. How come you life, have a picture of my mom? Life ain't always what it's like in books and fantasy stories. I suppose. Sometimes, sometimes a bad guy wins. Sometimes a good guy loses, and like we cut to uh, a scene of um, Jay and like looking at something that his dad or whatever, right? And then like then smash like smash cut. Then we like we cuts back to us, and uh, you know life's life's just sometimes messy and complicated. It has twists and turns that you can't ever see. And well, I guess what I'm just trying to say, man, I don't know Zeke. Your mom, your mom is really nice. She sure is. Best one I could ever have. You know, with uh, I'm gonna make up a name for your dad, right? Mm-hmm. Or for uh, Marshall, right? Like, and with 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 Marshall passing away in the in after the war and all. Well, I and. Marianne getting getting the influenza. Well, I know you probably don't want to hear it like this, but uh, hear what? Zeke, you know how I always call you son. Yeah. <laughs> I really meant it. <laughs> what? Yeah, <laughs> I, I think I think that might be like I'm. I I actually stand up as you're doing this heart to heart. Yeah, right. And yeah. I, I start walking towards the creek and bend over. What? Yeah. I'm your father, Zeke. I pick, up, I pick up like what looks like a, a shedding patch of scales. Yeah. What? Look what I found. What? I mean, let me look at, uh, at I, I come over and take a look at it. Scales. Yeah. Do they look like dukes or are they something else? Oh, they're like bigger than dukes. Yeah, I don't think duke had scales that big. Uh, oh, I look over and take a few more steps and here's some more. Oh, there's some more. I start following the trail. Oh, I think I see some over there too. Yeah, let's go, and we we follow it. I'm gonna see if we are able to find said danger. So I yeah. brought in you. I have three, so that's four. Um, and then I brought the flatbread. Flat. God damn it, <laughs> flatbread. <laughs> uh, which is because it's so flat. Because it's flatbed truck. And it so is. your your brain immediately wants to start yep. doing the truck part, the truck. Yep, 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 yep. Oh, I just thought you were getting hungry on the truck. Nice. Four successes. Four um, successes. Who wants to the position? I'll do it. I I already got it set up. Three. Nice. Whew, thank goodness. Nice. Awesome. We conquered that danger. Nice. And so, also, I spent one of my character points, so you can yeah. Yoink. Yeah, I was going to yoink that away. Oh, actually, but you could put two back anyways because I'm in the process it's, of using your insecurity. Yeah. Uh, so we uh, uh, follow the path and we come to a small uh, flat inlet cave um, that uh, the water seems to have carved out and uh, kind of stepping into it I don't go too deep but you can hear this deep rumble like a very slow patient breathing and as I step a little to the side allowing uh, light to cast through you can see the sheen of scales I kind of take a, a gasp and 
slowly step back out. I think I think I found his uncle. It's Duke's uncle. It's gotta be. Yeah, and then like for the last time, Duke ain't got no family, and then then they cut right. Well, then I, I look towards you and right. smile. Well, that's what I've been told, but I know that ain't true. Then I yeah. kind of give you a hug around the hip, and that's where we'll cut that. Yeah, <laughs> perfect. Lovely. The schmaltz is high. <laughs> <laughs> so that's the uh, the end of Act One. Um, the uh, beginning of Act Two. Um, involves uh some more uh some more uh uh, toughness so basically the pursuer gets or the secret gets one more hooray but the pursuer and danger both gets four more each and now the dice pool for the uh rolls is five they've basically got escalated oh man yeah so act one is all about kind of building up act two is trying to maintain as best you can do we want to yeah Yep, so I was going to say, all right, then we're going to take a quick five-minute break, and then we're going to come back for the last half. All right? Sounds awesome. Cool.